Good day, Team GCI. I'm Brad, and in today's GCI Market Outlook, let's take a look at Forex trading on Euro Dollar, the S&P 500, the NASDAQ, Gold and Silver. Gold and Silver both fell dramatically last Friday on optimism on the U.S. economy and the U.S. dollar. Before we look at that, don't forget to like, subscribe, and get notified on YouTube, Facebook, and Instagram. This may give us long opportunities on precious metals as price action on both has fallen to a lower trend line. Also, these stochastic oscillators looking very oversold and turning up. If we move out to the daily charts, the idea of an uptrend looks even more compelling, and some indicators like the parabolic SAR are still bullish. Both the S&P 500 and the NASDAQ have pulled back from their all-time highs, so we are waiting for an opportunity to buy the dip. If the optimism on the U.S. economy continues, this may work in our favor. Also, keep an eye on the stochastic oscillator for technical signs of an upturn. We are seeing Canadian dollar strength right across the board, but watch out for tomorrow's CPI, which will guide the Bank of Canada. If inflation comes down, we may see a weaker Canadian dollar temporarily to let us enter the trend at an advantage. We are seeing a falling wedge forming on price action on euro dollar, which is generally a bullish pattern. To find any key levels, we have to zoom way out to the weekly chart, where we see a symmetrical pennant and an oversold stochastic oscillator. That's all for now. CFDs and FX are leveraged products and your capital may be at risk.